got a Hershey cookie pizza decorating kit. That's a mouthful. We got it while we were in Hershey. If you didn't watch that video, check it out. Clearly our elves wanted to make this. Giant hearts around it. All crazy, they wanted to open it. But, before we start, you might need a little help from the parents. Let's do this. The directions are on the box, so I'm gonna be very careful when I open this. Cause I definitely don't wanna rip the directions. Like, I've done this stuff in the past. Whoa! Whoa! That's a lot of stuff. You need to make sure that I need to make it. sure I follow every single five directions mm -hmm. on here. The first one we already did, it was to preheat the oven, but there's also a second part on the first step. It says lightly greased cookie pan. We're gonna do that right now. Step one, we're greasing the pan. Step two, put your chocolate no, 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 into no. the bowl. Plus your Reese's Pieces and your sprinkles. Put them in the microwave, melt them, then they're going to be all creamy and gross, melt them, so then your Reese's giant cookie pizza will be nice and melty. Here we go. Make sure it's really greased up. Um, I'm going to mix it in the pan. My hands are all greasy, but we're on step two. Steps. Combine. Cookie mix, butter, and eggs. Mix until well blended. Pat dough evenly across bottom of pan. Let's do it. I got the egg. I spilled it everywhere, but there's still egg in there. I'm just gonna, it said combine everything. That didn't mean to happen. We're just gonna mix everything right here. I'm mixing my This dough. is not, this is not. This is not working out. Ah, right. look, it's stuck. It's an eggy butter. Ew. Ugh. Look. Mine isn't turning out good. Mine's very sticky. This is. Mine's so super sticky. Oh. Chopping up your chocolate chips. I feel like I almost got to like chop up the butter. No, you can chop up your chocolate chips. Then you add. Oh my gosh. This is. This is. Ah. I don't even know what to do. Do I chop it? Do I mix it? It's just... Ah! There we go. This works. You go... Ah! Ah! This is working. Ah! Chunky eggs and butter. Oh, oh there's chocolate chips in it. Yay! Oh. I always hate this part. It's like an explosion. Mm -hmm. All right, AJ's going for the mixy mixy. You want to start? Yes. Let's go. Mixy. mixy. Whoa! Be careful. We don't need an explosion. Now this one's getting thick. Yeah, you gotta get these chunky eggs. See, it's basically like cinnamon, how like cinnamon sucks up all the moisture. That's what happened to the egg. Got it all mixed, and now we're gonna be laying it on the bottom of our tin foil pan. I guess it's kind of like making pumpkin pie, but cookie pie. We're just gonna be spreading this all out, like whoosh, whoosh, whoosh. Might take a little bit. <laughs> Pure concentration. How is this gonna? I need help. All right, guys. Look at how this is coming out. I don't know. We followed all the directions. We did everything that we were supposed to. But it didn't even cover the whole pan. I don't know. We'll put it in the oven, but I don't know how this is gonna come out. So since it didn't fit in the original pan, I'm kind of making it just a little bit smaller. 
that way we're not like super spreading it out and then it'll work it's very sticky i don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing but i'm really hoping that this works out because the box has pretty awesome potential but i'm gonna go put this in the oven we set it at 350 degrees like they said. I'm too scared to do this. We're gonna have the parents do it. No way. Too scared. In the oven it goes. There we go. See you in 12 to 15 minutes. Surprising enough, it's actually turning out pretty good. But I can't show you guys yet. That's a surprise. All I'm gonna tell you is that it's spreading out. Bing, bing, bing! It's all ready. I think I know how to turn this off. I did it! I turned off the timer. Let's see it. Okay, we only put it in for 12 minutes and it said to take like a toothpick or something and the max was like 12 to 15. So. We might need more time, who knows? It actually came out pretty good. It looks like cookies, just a little bit smaller than the pan. So if I was remaking this, somehow add some more stuff. But we gotta make this cool down. No, I'm actually not joking. You need it to cool down so that all our goodies don't melt. We're gonna go make the icing right now. Let's go. All right guys, here goes nothing. Time to make our chocolate glaze. It says to put Butter, water, and chocolate chips. Sounds like an odd combination, not gonna lie. In the microwave and then do the mixy mixies every 15 seconds. Let's do this. Almost hit myself there, that would've been good. 15 seconds. Here we go. Fifteen seconds later. Oh, come on, it's in the back. You got it. it says to me. Ooh, ooh, that does not look good. Huh. It looks like barf. Ugh. Mixed with chocolate chips. It says we have to mix it in. This is. Not sure how this is gonna be turned into glaze, but now. I'm gonna put it back in the microwave for another 15 seconds. All right, second round, 15 seconds. Come out right now. Let's see what it looks like. Back again. Let's see. Okay, doesn't look like barf. Looks like watery chocolate. I don't know how this is gonna thicken up. I say we do it one more time, okay? Maybe. I'm not seeing, maybe like when they meant glaze, they meant, ugh, I don't know. It's like hot chocolate mixed with coffee mixed with butter. Not my cup of tea. Look at this. This is supposed to be a glaze. It's like diarrhea. Oh. I know it's made of chocolate, but. Sometimes when you misread teaspoons and tablespoons, you gotta bring out the big guns. Might not be Hershey chocolate syrup, but it's still chocolate syrup. Maybe this will thicken it up. Now I'm gonna do the mixy mix. Let's try. Added a lot of chocolate syrup, and it's still a little watery, but it's like more thick now, I guess you can say. I don't know. I mean, maybe like you put it in the freezer once you're done and like hardens, but serve right from the pan and enjoy. I don't know. This said it was easy. I thought there was five directions. This turns into like 5,000. I don't know. 
It does look good though. Our pan is now at room temperature. We're supposed to be putting this chocolate syrup mess on here. Personally, for the glaze, I think they should have added more chocolate chips. Who knows? Maybe it's because of that teaspoon mix-up. We just gotta read more carefully. So I guess we just put it on. Oh! Oh, that's cool. That isn't half as bad as I thought it was gonna be. Ready? That looks good. It almost looks like a pizza. Like you're putting on tomato sauce. Isn't that looking that bad? It's like dark brown tomato sauce. Alright guys, I just tasted it. It's strange. When I like first put it in my mouth, it was very watery and bleh. But then like at the end, I tasted the chocolate syrup, the chocolate chips. Definitely tasted to the butter though, which was not good. Let's go decorate. <laughs> Follow my skills as a chocolate chip master. Then both decorate them. Yeah, I got it. This looks like a sad thing. Let's not just put chocolate chips on it. Let's put some Reese's. That hit the ceiling, guys. I just threw up a chocolate chip and it hit the ceiling. Mount Fuji and broccoli. Here we come. Whoa. Didn't see that. Let's put some of these on. We love our races. Oh, that looks like a masterpiece. All right, clearly our pizza does not look like the one on the box, but as they say, don't judge a book by its cover. So I'm going to guess cut us a piece. Looks strange. It looks kind of gross, but it might be good. Oh, it might be good. You never know. Like a pie slice? Yeah, like a little tiny pie slice. All right. I'll try. If I can actually get it out. Okay. You know you gotta wait for me, right? All right, there's Ooh. AJ's little Christmas tray. I'm gonna go for this side. It looks, it feels, it, oh, it smells like, it smells bad. All right, let's see here. My, geez, that's a beautiful slice. Don't smell it, because it does not smell All right. good. It smells really good. Here we go. Don't Cheers. Don't smell it. Cookie. Mm -hmm. We tried it, we made it, we tasted it. I don't really know. I mean, on my part, I think the cookie itself could have been a little less chewy and cooked a little more. The glaze could have been a little more thick. So, I don't know. I would say it's like, has potential to be kid approved, but isn't really. Like it's, it's going on the low side. It needs a little work, Hershey. So, I think this is something that we haven't been able to say yet. I don't think that the Hershey Cookie Pizza Decorating Kit is that kid approved yet. Maybe they just need some work. 
Or what? Or maybe we just tried again, cook it a little more. Or maybe we just did it wrong. But either way, we'll see you guys next time. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Bye!